Ezekiel Ezekiel chapter 13. The word of Adonai came to me, human being, prophesy against the prophets of Israel who prophesy. Tell those prophesying out of their own thoughts. Listen to what Adonai says. Adonai Elohim says, Woe to the vile prophets who follow their own spirits and things to which they have not seen. Israel, your prophets have been like jackals among ruins. You prophets have not gone up to the breaks in the barricade or repaired it for the house of Israel so that they can stand fast in battle on the day of Adonai. Their visions are futile and their divination is false. They say, Adonai says, when Adonai has not sent them, yet they hope that the word will be confirmed. Haven't you had a futile vision and spoken a false divination when you say, Adonai says, and I have not spoken? Therefore, here is what Adonai Elohim does say. Because you have spoken futilities and even falsehoods, therefore I am against you, says Adonai Elohim. My hand will be against the prophets who have futile visions and produce false divinations. They will not be allowed into the council of my people, or be written in the register of the house of Israel, or enter the land of Israel. Then you will know that I am Adonai Elohim. They deserve this, because they have led my people astray by saying there is peace when there is no peace. If someone builds a wall without mortar, they plaster it with whitewash and makes it appear strong. Tell these plasterers that a cloudburst is coming with huge hailstones and gale force winds, and the wall will fall down. Then people will ask you, where is the whitewash you used to plaster it? Therefore, Adonai Elohim says, In my rage I will cause gale force winds to break out, and in my anger there will come a cloudburst with huge hailstorm to consume it in fury. This is how I will break down the wall you covered with whitewash. I will smash it to the ground so that its foundation will be revealed. The wall will fall down and you will be consumed with it. Then you will know that I am Adonai. In this way, I will spend my fury on the wall and on those who covered it with whitewash. I will say to you, the wall is gone and so are those who plastered it. That is, the prophets of Israel who prophesy about Yerushalayim and see visions of peace for her when there is no peace, says Adonai Elohim. You, human being, turn your face against the daughters of your people, who prophesy out of their own thoughts. Prophesy against them. Tell them that Adonai Elohim says, Woe to the women who sew, sew magic pads for all arm joints and put veils over people of all sizes in order to hunt human lives. Will you hunt down the lives of my people while you keep your own lives safe? You dishonor me before my people for a few handfuls of barley and crumbs of bread killing people who should not die and sparing those who should not live by your lying to my people who love hearing lies. Therefore, here is what Adonai Elohim says, I am against your pads with which you hunt human lives like birds. I will tear them from your arms and let the lives go. Yes, the human lives that you hunt like birds. I will also tear your veils and rescue my people from your clutches so that they will no longer be in your power for you to hunt. Then you will know that I am Adonai, because you have disheartened the righteous with your lies, when I was not trying to cause them pain, and have encouraged the wicked not to turn from their wicked ways, and thus be saved. Therefore, you will have no more futile visions, and you will produce no more divinations. I will rescue my people from your clutches, and you will know that I am Adonai.